I'm grateful to serve this year as the 2019 Chairman of the Board for the Richardson Chamber of Commerce. I'm looking forward to this year and all that we're going to be able to accomplish. As we do each year, we provide a number of goals that we, we want to achieve throughout the year. We did seven this year and you'll find those out on our website. However, there are a few today that I'd like to just to highlight and share with you my interest, my passion, and my desire for achieving these goals. One of the first goals that I'm really excited about is, is how we as a chamber help attract the businesses to the city of Richardson. Last year we were successful in doing that. We were able to fill 1.3 million square feet of class A and B office space. Now there's always a need. There's always an office space that needs to be filled and that goal is still one of the things that we want to achieve this year by setting another goal of filling another million square feet. So I'm excited about the opportunities that we're going to be able to have in being able to do that. But we need your help. We need everybody to help pitch in and to help us attract these type of businesses that we look forward to having here in the city of Richardson. The other thing that I think is incredibly uh, impactful for us to, to stay focused on is improving our workforce. You know, so many times people will, will say, how did you get started in your business? And it wasn't because I came out of high school or college and decided that's what I wanted to do. It was because an opportunity presented itself. Well, we want to present those opportunities. And so we have partnered with Art Richardson ISD and the city in promoting iDream and the, and the mayor's internship to be able to promote what goes on in the community and to help foster young minds as they, as they begin to develop interest in different career paths. By doing this, what we hope to do here in the city of Richardson and, and in this area is to develop an interest in some of the trade schools, some of the trades that we're seeing a deficiency in, in the area of maybe a plumber, electrician, uh, or maybe who knows, an insurance guy like me. But those things are important because it's not always about being a doctor or a lawyer or something that seems to be flashy to a young child as they're going through grade school, but because we practically need all of these people to be able to make a city run and a community be become as best as it can be. The third area that, that really excites me is our work around the innovation of the East Arapahoe area and what we're going to call the Innovation District. I'm excited about that because what that's going to do is that's going to take our, our partnership and our relationship with both the University of the UTD of Dallas as well as Richland College and use their talents as feeders into this innovation district and then working in conjunction with the city to build an infrastructure so that, that it will allow for those creative minds to come in, for startups to foster, for, or for uh, combined workspace areas and for the minds of uh, these entrepreneurs to come and to be creative with their ideas and to have an area that can be focused on that specifically for that. And so we're excited about the relationship with, this, with the city of Richardson and all that the chamber is going to be able to do to help facilitate and to grow the Innovation District here in the city of Richardson. So as a, as a final comment or two, I would say this, get involved. Be, be proactive in your efforts here in the city of Richardson. We would love to have you. Some people think that it's always about being on the board or you got to always provide a way financially. That's not the case. What you need to do is just be willing to get involved. We have many committees, we have many programs, we have many ways between what we do and what we do with the city that you could be a big part in this. It's the talents of each of us, all of us collectively together that will make this, this community great and continue to support the growth that the city of Richardson is looking forward to. So thank you for the opportunity for me to serve this year as the, as the chair of the board. I'm grateful for it, I look forward to it, and I look forward to engaging you throughout the year. Thank you.